Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the Overwatch Anniversary Update. One year on from the release of the greatest game we are celebrating with 11 new legendary skins, something like 30 new emotes, and a whole bunch of other amazing stuff. Over a hundred items in total have been added to the game. 101 crates is Quite simply put, not gonna cut it. So today, to celebrate the one year anniversary of Overwatch and the fact that I look really horrible in snapback caps, we are gonna be unboxing 201 of the new Overwatch loot boxes as well as giving away $200 of Battle.net gift cards as is our custom. If you want info on that, I will have all the info at the end of the video on the giveaway or you can probably just read about it down in the description. But for now, let's start jumping into these loot boxes and give me a second to remove this horrible snapback because as you can see, it doesn't really mix well with my kind of hair. Here we go, loot box number one. There is so much amazing stuff for us to find, and this is quite possibly the widest background that has ever existed ever. It's, it's basically just a blank portrait, because if my pale face didn't already look bad enough, they just wanted to make it worse. And we're starting off with a player icon, which is really not where we wanted to begin. But that said, we just gotta keep going through. We have 199 loot boxes to go, and, well, I mean, we've got basically as much time as we need to get through it, but I need as much time as I can get. Too slow. I like that. I'll equip it. Once again, voice lines in these boxes never really make sense to me, but if they sound cool, they sound cool. Now, there are 11 new legendary skins, or 12 maybe. Basically, all of them, I had a look through the list, are completely awesome. And on top of that, there are also 24 new dance emotes added to the game. One for every hero. And on top of that, they've also added in some stuff like a sitting emote for Arissa. I believe a sitting emote for Sombra. As well as a whole bunch of other stuff. So long story short, we got a lot of things to unbox. And the first one is gonna be... Farah playing the rocket guitar. Holy shit. It even comes with sound effects. This is my new thing. I can't think of a single hero that I'm not going to have the dance emote equipped on. Because pretty much all of them are completely freaking amazing. Look at that. Okay, let's keep going. I'm sorry. I, I need to not get caught up on each one. Because basically all of these dance emotes are amazing. The problem is there are 24 of them. So if I do that for every single one, well, we're going to run into some problems. And I think you can probably also understand why I got 200 loot boxes. Because even if we get a new emote in every one in every four boxes, that would still only just get them over all of the 200. So we got to keep going. We just got to keep unboxing. I can't, I'm not even going to listen to voice lines, guys. I'm sorry. We are sticking to skins and emotes. Give it to me. And it's fucking gold. Are you kidding me? I got 9,000 of the stuff already. But guys, I also brought along some props today because I thought I would show you some kind of, a couple of things that, oh wait, we got to check this first. Oh, here we go. I love that, actually. The running rat. Once again, cannot let myself get stuck up on it, though. We just got to keep going through. We just got to keep on moving and unboxing more and more. So I brought a couple of things that I thought I'd show you about my kind of like Overwatch journey while we're getting through these 200 loot boxes. Because Overwatch for me started a long, long time ago. And it's just a legendary skin that we've already got. When I went to uh, PAX East, I think in 2015, and I got these Overwatch sunglasses here, which are limited edition, can't get them anymore. Very, very special. And on top of that, as we move on, move on to our next loot box, I also got this necklace here, which I as you can see, has a whole bunch of really cool Overwatch pins on it. And they gave one of those pins if you got play of the game at the Overwatch booth. And I've kept them all ever since. So I thought that was a cool little thing to show with you. Then on top of that, just got my Overwatch mug. Currently filled with an energy drink because, well, it's like 2 a.m. in the morning in Australia. And Papa Muse Up needs his energy to get through these boxes. Okay, let's just keep moving. Hey, dipstick, that's a real Australian word. They did it for once. Please. Yes, there we go. Guys, it is a real life Zaya skin that doesn't look like total crap. I feel like the kind of theme for this box, it, it kind of also feels like they've kind of just gone to the artists and been like, hey, what's some skin that you've always wanted to create? And they've just gone and made it. But the general theme for this update seems to be a kind of like cybernetic style theme, which I think is awesome. Because all the skins I've seen in the previews are amazing. And oh my god, we have so many boxes to go. I'm just going to start like holding down spacebar while I drink my Red Bull. 
and pray for a legendary or a dance emote. Oh, here we go. It's Torbjorn. What are we going to get? Oh, okay. He, that is not the face of a happy man. He does not look like he's having a good time dancing. Doesn't matter. We're going to equip it anyway. And then we're going to keep on moving through our loot boxes. Now, the awesome thing about the dance emotes, for anyone wondering if, if you haven't uh, been told yet or you didn't know yet, they do, in fact, loop. Just like, uh, like the conga taunt in TF2, for example. So, long story short, I don't know how this is going to be affecting the kind of entire Overwatch ecosystem. I don't quite think we're going to get something like the TF2 conga apocalypse that happened after they added that to the game. But, I'm expecting to see some more sexy skins. Oh my god. Hanzo, Zaya, two heroes who haven't had a good skin added to the game in so long. And now they come out with this, which looks absolutely freaking incredible. Let's keep going. I just want all of the new legendaries. That I guess that kind of goes without saying, but I, I, sorry, I don't just want the new legendaries. It would make a lot more sense and it would be a lot more correct if I said I need them. And we're just getting blues. Actually, to be fair, I say we're just getting blues. In reality, we've actually got some pretty good things already. So I shouldn't be too greedy. And we have got 175 fucking boxes to go. We are not even one... We are one-eighth of the way through this. My god. If any of you actually make it through this entire thing, just, just give yourself a pat on the back. I'm going to leave like some secret message at some random point in the video and just see if anyone in the comment section actually manages to put it down. Oh my god, did I just miss an Arisa taunt? I hope I didn't miss the Arisa taunt. We'll probably get it as a dupe later anyway. I got to start paying attention to what is coming out of these boxes because I need to see all these new dance emotes. And you know what's so horrible? I don't know if all loot boxes have done this. I swear they haven't. But look at those four little tokens when they pop out of the top of the box on this one. They all appear like they're legendary. They all look gold until they explode. Whereas I swear in updates past, it's been like one of each color or it's been kind of like a rainbow. But these, it's like, oh yeah, you got four legendaries. Oh no, fuck you. It's actually four duplicates and a blue. Okay. I'm just crushing my dreams more. Like it wasn't done enough already. Or just give me coins. Oh boy, I mean, I guess the plus side of coins is if there are any dance emotes that we're missing at the end of this, or any really cool skins, we can just always jump in and grab them. Okay, I'm trying to think, like, if we just keep unboxing, what do you reckon will be the fastest time you could get through 200 of these loot boxes? It would, it would probably still take a very, very long time, especially when I'm just getting blues. Oh, look, so it, I think, I think the new kind of uh, profile icons they've added for the anniversary, it's just like the original kind of, um class icons you can get for your profile, except now they are gold. So, I mean, take from that what you will. It's definitely cooler. Gold is never a bad thing. And oh, what's Hanzo gonna be? See, I'm conflicted here. Hanzo is a very serious, super, you know, down tight dude. You know, he's he, he doesn't have a lot of fun. So I'm wondering, is his dance gonna be very fun? Oh my God. Oh, okay, no, you look at that face. That is the face of a man. He is not dancing for fun. This is like a workout regime for him. And that looks like he is really good on the thighs. Okay, we should... Once again, we gotta keep moving because I cannot stop. I will not stop for anything. You know what I'm gonna do? Actually, I think as soon as I'm done this, I'm gonna go create a private server. And you know all those like XXX roleplay servers? I'm just gonna have a server that's gonna be Muzog's dance server. It'll be completely... No one can harm each other. If you shoot, you get kicked. All you're allowed to do is be friends. And I got Zenyatta! Oh, this is the one I really wanted, because for those of you who don't know, I am a Zenyatta main. And I just, I have to watch how this one plays out. Oh my god, that looks amazing! Can we just stop for a second and appreciate the animation quality in Overwatch? Like, the way the balls, everything is so smooth. It's amazing. Okay, and I should probably equip that. And then move on, because how many boxes do we have? 160, my god! I'm starting to feel like, oh, double legendary. Woo. The new 76. I really wanted this. I want to know what the gun looks like as well. But I guess we'll have to find that out later. It seems like the Overwatch artists have got like a real kind of, I don't want to call it fetish, but a real thing for, for just knocking limbs off people. Like McCree has got one arm. 
Junkrat's got one leg. In this skin, they've taken both of 76's feet and he's got bionic legs. I mean, I feel like almost every hero, not every hero, but quite a lot of Overwatch heroes are just missing different limbs from their bodies, which, I mean, if I was signing up to Overwatch and I saw all the people I'm about to go and join missing like half their body parts, I, I'm, I would probably go and just take up a career in YouTube or just work at McDonald's, one of the two. Okay, now, one of the skins that I'm really keen to get, that just reminded me there, is Lucio. There is, and I don't know how else to describe it, a pimp Lucio skin. And the cool thing about this is it's not just a reskin of what Lucio is, it actually changes his tracks, like the music tracks he plays when he's healing in-game. So instead of having his standard tracks, it's got these, like, kind of, um, I think steampunk themed or kind of, like, old style themed. I'll need to actually get in-game and try them out, which, as you guys know, we always do at the end of the video. We kind of go into the training range and try some out, as well as kind of do all the kind of information around the giveaway, which is, I'm sure you guys already know, probably gonna run the same way as all the other ones have, which is just be subscribed and leave a comment down below. But for right now, let's keep on moving. Through the boxes, more boxes, more skins, actually. We're a bit light on the legendaries right now. Like, I understand there are a hundred new items in these boxes, so there's a lot for us to get through. But I feel like we've been through about 50 already. And I feel like we're definitely overdue for a legendary in this box right here. I'm going to not do that anymore because apparently that's bad luck. We got... <laughs> <laughs> Three whites and a blue. Oh my god. Oh, there it is. Sorry guys. I was one box too late and that is Gorgeous. I saw him in the preview video and I was instantly in love. Oh, look at the pattern on Ganymede That's awesome. June buggy Bastion That is all oh, I guess because he can be a June buggy because he can transform into a car. I get it now Okay, just more profile icons. I don't want profile icons. I want energy drink and I want skins and maybe some dance emotes, but definitely not money. I need to stop getting the currency. We've got enough of that, as you can probably already see. Okay. Now, my second question here is, will this be the longest video that I've ever made? I don't actually know what the longest video I've ever made is, but I feel like 200 loot boxes is going to start pushing it there. I also feel like the more energy drink I'm drinking, the faster I'm getting through these. Like, it's not only speeding up my brain, it's speeding up my unboxing. What? Oh, I thought he was about to sit down for a second. <laughs> McCree looks like another one who's... Oh, no, he's into it. Oh, this is how he gets the ladies. Look at that. And the lady. <laughs> oh, there you go. Okay, let's keep going. More boxes. More skins. More dancing. More of everything that I want in this life. And for a second, I thought we got the McCree dancing emote again. That would have really made me salty. I wonder if it's actually possible to get two of the same item in one box. I think it actually is. But I don't think it's ever happened to me. Not At least not with a legendary. And just voice lines for now. We need more skins, people. We got 76. We got... Who else did we get? We got Bastion. But I really want Lucio. It's like every time they add a new box, I've got like a thing that I want more than any other thing. And for this box, it is absolutely 100% lootly the new Lucio. So give it to me. That's all I'm asking. We are going to get a legendary skin in this box. Right here. There it isn't. I'm once a guy. Just, I, don't, I thought maybe second time was a charm. But apparently not. <laughs> apparently not. No, we just get three whites and a blue. Just fuck me, right? I'm just trying to invest, sorry, I, I was about to say, I'm about to invest my money in Overwatch, but that would apply, that would imply that it's a smart financial decision that's going to bring me some kind of return. No, I, I'm, I'm throwing my money away at Overwatch. Man, after this, it's going to be coming down to a very close tie between which game I've wasted more money in, TF2 or Overwatch. And I genuinely don't know which. The other thing that I'm really interested in is if they're going to have to end up reworking... Oh, here we go. I'll tell you in a second. After we've checked out Sombra. Oh, yeah. Oh, she got the moves. 
Oh, you know, I want to, I want to, I want to, I want to know in the comment section at the end of the, this video. This is, this is the secret question for those of you who are tuning into the video. We're not even halfway through, but I'm already going to ask you the secret question just because I really want to know who dances the best. Who's got the best moves? Tell me in the comments at the end of the video, because I mean, I've got my own personal opinions, which is obviously Zenyatta because he is amazing. But tell me what you think. Okay. Let's keep going. I've also heard that Soldier 76's dance is really cringy, and I cannot wait to see it. He does not look like he's enjoying it. So, as I was saying about the loot boxes, because eventually it's going to get to a stage where everyone's kind of got all the items that are in the standard loot boxes. They're not really updating them anymore, other than with like one or two things. So... I feel like they're going to reach a point where everyone's just got all those items. They're getting nothing but duplicates. And then they're going to have to do some massive rework of the loot box system. And I, I kind of think they, they just underestimated how much people liked unboxing. So hopefully we cannot get more Hanzo skins. And hopefully they'll have that kind of rework coming in soon. Because I would love to see some kind of... I don't know, just something really, really rare inside standard loot boxes. Kind of like unusuals from TF2, because I feel like that would just add so much more excitement to opening things. I don't know, for me at least. Then again, I am an unboxing addict, if it wasn't already clear from what's happening in front of you. So, you know, that might just be me. Okay, I need to stop getting the sprays and the player icons and the voice lines. Give me the emotes! That's an emote! There we go. Okay, let's check it out. Tracer. I feel like Tracer, she's... she. She's going to be a dancer. She's going to have some moves. Oh, yeah. Oh, my lord. Just look at you, you spectacular thing. Let's just move on from there before anything gets... I, I love... I lo You know, just everything about that. From, you know, the butt to the actual dancing. It's all great. But that's just Tracer in a nutshell anyway. I don't know whether they deliberately... Gave her a set of dance moves that really show off the hip button movement. But, I mean, this is Blizzard and the Overwatch team we're talking about. So, I'm going to say that that's probably what's gone down here. Dipstick. Dipstick. Finally, a voice line to represent Australia as a whole. That or Nong. I would, I would also approve of the word Nong. And I swear if I keep getting coins, I'm going to get really, really sad. The good news is we're starting to get so many credits that uh, we can essentially buy whatever I want at the end of this. So if we do happen to be missing something, I can always go back and get it. Okay, what, that's, yeah, that's not a dance emote, keep going. I'm wondering what Genji is gonna be. Is he gonna be like in the mood for some good dance moves or not? And oh my God, Diva's new skin. I don't know if you guys have seen it. It's like farm girl Diva. It is like on the same cuteness level as police Diva. It's pretty amazing. And she is wearing skinny jeans. Just putting that out there as a thing. And that Orisa spray is amazing. Why don't I have that equipped? I'm going to need to go back and do that after we're done here. Are we down to 100 boxes yet? We're up to 111. We are whittling things down very, very quickly here. And we're going to get to the bottom in hopefully not too long. Welcome. You're welcome. Oh, I, yes. You know what? I like that because Try me. it's just... just you're welcome. I feel like so many Mercy players want to say that to people they're healing all the time. And that is not a legendary that I wanted, but that is a dance emote that I did. Oh, yeah. Man, I love it. I love it how even the super serious Overwatch heroes, like, when it, when it comes to busting out the dance moves, they're, they're, ready to, they're ready to cut back a bit. You know, they're ready to chill out, have a bit of fun. Can you imagine setting up a kill gate in a room? And then people just walk in and they're just getting mowed down and Symmetra is just in the corner, like dancing over their corpses. This is something that I need to do. And this is something that is definitely going to happen. Oh my god, dance emotes. As a TF2 player, I've waited so long. And they're finally here. Okay. More blues. More blues. Just, just keep cycling through the blues. No one cares about the blues. What I do care about is energy drinks. What is Zenyatta's new voice line? How disappointing. Oh, that is another great support line. It's like I've just tried saving my entire team. I mean, healing them up, discording the enemy, then they all die. How disappointing. As they're all spectating me and I'm walking away, how disappointing. This is perfect. I want to know what Anna's is as well. And please be the new... Oh, yes! Beekeeper May. 
Now, while that... Oh my god, it's adorable. Look at the... the, 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 the her robot. Um, Snowball. Snowball. He's a... He's even got little atlas on the top. That's so gorgeous. Oh my god, give it to me now. Okay. Just, just, I feel like, oh, we're just, I want Lucio. Give me the Lucio. That's all I'm craving. That's all I want in this world. And we still got about a hundred boxes left. So I definitely think we have the potential to get it. We just gotta, I, I'm gonna have to start going faster. I'm gonna literally hold space. Oh my God, no, Arissa's dancing. This is the one I missed. And that is beautiful. Apparently they also added an Arissa sitting emote and I need to check that one out as well. Oh my god. She's so amazing. Everything about Orissa is just so good. I mean, just dance emotes as a whole. I'm sure you can all imagine this. Murdering someone in like cold, cold blood and then just dancing on their corpse. Like, it's going to be so much fun. And then like someone kills your friend and they're dancing on their corpse. And then you turn around the corner and you shoot them in the head. And then you go and you dance on that person's corpse. And then their team does the same thing. And then it just creates like an endless loop where everyone's just dancing on each other's corpses. And it never ends. A lot like this loot box unboxing. Because apparently I feel like I've just got unlimited crates right now. And we're never going to reach the bottom. Ooh, that is a lot of currency. We're hitting the 15,000 mark. I wonder if we'll get to... I reckon we'll get to 20,000 by the end of this. I reckon we will definitely get to 20,000 credits by the end of this. Come on. Where is my Lucio, you son of a bitch? Jeff, I have just put a stupid amount of money into your game. And keep in mind, when I buy stuff, it's in US dollars. And converting from US dollars to Australian dollars is, like, really painful. It's like $100 is actually more like 130 So, it, like, I think I'm not spending... I, I think I'm already, I already think I'm spending a decent amount. And then I have to convert it to Australia. And then I'm like, oh my god. I'm going to be eating out of a can for the next week. Okay. Oh, yes! Dancing Reaper! Give it to me! I really hope he... Oh, no! We've been trolled! Please tell me he just suddenly breaks out into dance. Please. Oh. Of course. One of the guys had to be too cool to be a dancer. And I should have seen that coming, but it was Reaper. <laughs> He's too cool to dance. I'm definitely not too cool Fly to dance, casual. though. Fly casual. I like it. Now, I'm trying to think what skins we're still missing. We're missing, obviously, Lucio. And there are, I'm pretty sure, about three or four other legendaries. Because there were 11 total. And we've only got, like, maybe, like, six so far. So there is a lot left for us to find. And there are about 90 loot boxes for it to be in. Then again, I think we all knowing my unboxing luck, we can expect a lot of duplicates. Oh, man. The sass in these new voice lines is amazing. Come on. Oh, I thought it was the May dance emote. This isn't what I wanted to- Oh, please! There it is! Look at her! Look! At! Just, 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 just look at her! It's like Cowgirl Diva. What, what's she called? She's called Cruiser. And just the important angle for anyone, because people always want to see. That, she's, she's got like a little air freshener up the top of the- Oh my god. Ugh. I don't know whether you should actually go into battle wearing, like, high heels or, like, flats slash high heels, but... You know what? That's her choice. That is a really cool skin, though. All these new skins are amazing. Also, second question. If you've been in the video this long, this is now your second secret question. What is your favorite skin in the new loot boxes? See? We're gonna have it like a tiered thing. That way we're gonna know who got through how much of this entire thing. Please, Widowmaker, pull out some sick ballroom dancing moves. I believe in you. No! Oh, yes. Oh my god, I just remembered. Before... Before, um, Widowmaker became a member of Talon and went through all the crazy, crazy stuff, she was a ballerina in France. So this actually fits her character so well. And I should have seen that coming. Look at those poses. Okay, let's move on now. That is absolutely beautiful. All of these dancing emotes are absolutely beautiful. Except for Reaper, who is a party pooper. 
and just, you know, apparently he thinks he's too cool for it. Yes, I'm going hog wild too, Roadhog. We're all going hog wild. I really hope there's like some voice line about like wasting money because I feel like that would really, you know, that would speak to me as a person. And, you know, the kind of poor life decisions I, I tend to be making. And oh, wait, we already got McCree. Uh, it's the Milady dance. No! We already got the Milady dance! Oh, here we go, Genji! Okay, Genji. Serious, not serious. I'm going with the not serious. He's gonna be down for it. He's fucking Cyber Ninja, dude. Oh, yeah. They're Look at the energy! That is a ma- that is that is a man who has danced in his youth. That is okay. I don't, I'm not I'm not gonna say it. That might almost be my new favorite one, even over Zenyatta. I I think that might actually be my new favorite dance emote. God damn it! I think I think Zenyatta's been taken off his pedestal. How could this happen? Okay, we just gotta keep going though. More boxes, more opening, more gold, more legendaries. How is that a legendary skin, man? Arissa is... She, I, I would say Arissa is the worst skinned hero at the moment. And no, I didn't want a duplicate. I said I wanted Lucio. Give me Lucio. And give me dancing emote for Lucio. I want the new Lucio skin and his dancing emote, please. Thank you. I feel like I'm not asking for too much here. Then again, this is Overwatch we're talking about. Okay, come on. Just keep moving faster and faster and faster and faster. Yes! Oh, it's another Dancing Reaper. I'm not going to click on that, because I'll just get disappointed again. And... No! Just profile icons! Come on, Lucio! You've got to be in one of these boxes! I know you're in here! I think I would quite honestly be the unluckiest person ever if we didn't get Lucio on one of these. And it's, it's just a duplicate Dancing Fire. There are 24, or more like 30 new emotes, I think. And we're getting duplicates. This is not cool, Blizzard. Not cool. What would be cool would be Lucio. Yes! Look at that man. Look at him. Steam, punk, jazzy Lucio. And he has got custom music backing him up. That is so good. This is, like, one of the new best skins in all of Overwatch, in my opinion. And I cannot wait. At the end of the video, we'll jump into the training range, and we'll try him out so you can hear what the, uh, what the new kind of music track sounds like. Now all we need is Lucio's dancing emote to pair along with that, and I am a happy man. I am sold. I am done. I am good to go. Give it to me right here. And it's, it's, oh, we got, no, it's, it's duplicate, duplicate dancing Arissa. Fuck you, Overwatch. You really hate me that badly. Okay, how many we got? We got 60 loot boxes left, guys. We're actually getting towards the end. We are gonna do it. And, okay, she's still dancing. We just got Arissa two boxes in a row. That's just cruel. And, okay, just more duplicates. Look at the coins just covering the ground after every box. It's ridiculous. Oh, that's one of the ones we're missing. Genji. Genji has got a legitimate Power Ranger skin. Well, that's as close to the thing I can describe it as. It is like Power Ranger Genji. And it is just stunningly amazing. And I need it in my life to, be, to, to live happily ever after. Please let this be it. Okay, it's Duplicate 76. Just crush, just crush my heart. Just crush it. Take all my dreams. Put them in a bowl, feed them to Jeff Kaplan. And yes, we got pissed off 76 dancing. Everybody, I introduce to you the old man shuffle. Or just what's called the dance emote. <laughs> that is like my dad, if he was like out trying to dance in, in, in some kind of bar and he had a few too many drinks, that is exactly what it would look like. And I'm sure any of you who have seen your parents dance can confirm this is an incredibly accurate emote. Okay, let's keep going. 58 loot boxes left. We are getting through things. And we're going to do it. Just keep going. Just keep going more and more and more. I'm almost out of energy drink here, people. This is a problem. This is a real problem. And we still need Power Ranger Genji. 
And that is not a Power Ranger Genji. That is another profile icon. At, at this point, I mean, the good news is I'm basically going to have my choice of whatever profile icon I could ever want. So, I mean, we got, we got that going for me, which is, I guess, okay. Not as good as Power Ranger Genji, though. So, we're going to keep going. Where are, my, where are my sunnies? Maybe if we put these on, they'll give us the power we need to get what I want. I'm going to keep it on for five loot boxes. We'll see if our luck goes up. There is, there is such a thing as superstition. And we're starting things off with a purple. So I feel like that's a good sign. Now turn it into a legendary or more purples. There we go, another purple. This is a thing. We got Dancing Zaya. And I just want to say how disappointed I am that she's not doing the polka dance. Where, you know, they put their hands up and they put their knees out. Like, she's Russian. I thought that would make sense. She's really just kind of giving everyone the gun show. And showing off her butt at the very end. <laughs> That's like, this is like, they, they were like, hey, Zaya, can you dance? And she just really wanted an excuse to show off how ripped she is. So she kind of just did like a slightly more mobile version of the gun show. Okay, maybe the sunglasses luck isn't a real thing. I'm going to try it out for one more. And then we're going to go back to normal. Please, please. No, God damn it. I was about to throw these, but they're way too special. Never throw limited edition sunglasses ever. Full stop. That's just the thing. You don't do it. Come on. No, not more voice lines. Okay, we're down to... We've got less than 50 boxes left. Which is still a fucking lot of boxes. But we are going to get to the end. We will reach the end of our mission. We will get Dancing Lucio. And we will get Power Ranger Genji. If we believe in ourselves. And to be fair, I often have very little faith in my unboxing skills. But today... It's the Overwatch anniversary. I feel like there's just so many good vibes floating around. Come on. More. Give me more. And by the way, I don't know if you guys saw as well, but they've also added... Oh my god, my hair is going crazy. You can tell this is what I'm getting really worked up from the unboxing. I don't know if you guys saw, but they added three new maps for the elimination mode, which is like the 3v3, 1v1 maps. And another one of the Bastions. Which, and they've also changed the rule set for that a bit. I haven't had a chance to go in and try it yet. But from what I've heard from talking to people, the changes are really good. So I am super keen to go and try them again. And you know what? I'm not even mad we got a duplicate because, I mean, you can never have too much of, of Hipster Lucio, really. I mean, that's just a fact. Now give me what I want. Give me Dancing Lucio and give me my Power Ranger. I have 20,000 credits. I don't need more credits. I don't need more duplicates. I need Power Ranger. And I need dancing. And I need them now. Please give them to me. That is a blue. That is not a gold or a purple. I was actually really worried. When I first saw the dance emotes, I, like, there was a thought that ran through my brain, which was, oh my god, I don't need another one of you, 76. We're literally all soldiers now. I had a thought run through my brain when I saw the dance emotes that they might actually, oh my god, Dancing Hog, they might be legendaries, kind of like Divas are playing games one. And can you imagine the cost of all the items if they were? It would be like 300,000 credits to buy everything. Here we go. Oh my god, he's so adorable. He's just like slowly spinning. I gotta say, like the actual animation quality on these dance emotes is amazing. Like, it's so smooth. Please, that's not what I wanted, Overwatch. I don't know whether I should be angry at Jeff Kaplan or Overwatch, or just like my own crappy unboxing. Like, I kind of feel like I have this coming for myself. I deserve this. Because, I mean, actually, this is probably good. You know, it's like it's like the opposite of those CSGO gambling people that did all those videos. Because when they did their videos and they showed themselves winning at CSGO gambling, they encourage everyone else to go and waste their money. You watching me and me getting like four duplicates and blues, this is encouraging you to not Go and waste your money on loot boxes. Don't be like me, people. Be better than me. And and invest in stock market and popsicles and other more enjoyable things than duplicates. Okay, we're getting down to the wire here, man. We do not have many boxes left to go. We've got 27. We are seven-eighths of the way through this unboxing. And still no Power Ranger Genji. Which, I'm not going to lie, 
is causing me a little bit of salt right now. Oh my god. Just stop teasing me with the legendaries. Give me what I want. Give me what I want. That's not what I want. That is that is completely not what I asked for. Okay, this is we're getting down to the wire here, guys. I genuinely don't know if we're gonna get the items. Two, two hundred fucking loot boxes, and I still don't get the Power Ranger Genji and the Dancing Lucio, which were in like my top three items. We got we got we got the Lucio skin. That was number one. But I would say coming in after that was basically Genji and Dancing Lucio, and we have got neither right now. This is unbelievable. Come on, just just go. Just go. Just give me. We are really you're making me nervous, Overwatch. You're making me nervous. And I don't like being nervous. Okay. Come on. No, give me the emote. Yes! Dancing Lucio with the steampunk skin. Let's see. I feel like of all the people. Wow. Actually, that's that's that that's pretty smooth. Oh, that is smooth. I was gonna say, of every single hero in the game that I would expect to have like some sweet dance moves, Lucio is definitely the one. Like, he has to be looking good. Okay, let's keep going. We're almost at the end now, guys. We're only missing the Genji. Power Ranger Genji. And we have 16 loot boxes to get him. Come on, Overwatch. Don't fail me now. Look, I, I kind of want to like strike a bargain with, with the devil and be like, look, man, you give me lots of good items. Then everyone watching this thinks that they can do it too. And then they'll go buy loot boxes and then you guys will be rich and it'll be amazing. But no, I, I'm like the anti-unboxing YouTube channel. Like, just don't, you, you watch my stuff and you're like, no, why would I ever do that? It's clearly just a horrible waste of funds. I mean, maybe the fact, maybe the reason you guys are watching this is because you are smarter than me and because you don't waste hundreds of dollars on virtual items. God. It's okay though. See? This is why I'm living out of like a pizza box. Because, I mean, who needs money for real food, right? When you can order pizza and then live off that for two days because it's big enough and, oh God, I need to get my life together. Okay, the final nine boxes. That was loot box number 10. Loot box number 9 is going to be complete crap. But loot box number 8, on the other hand, is going to have two legendaries in it. Get ready. Okay, that is just... I, I mean, a blue is kind of like a legendary, I guess. Not really, though. Just, just give me Genji. Just give me Genji. We got dancing. We got the dancing mercy. This isn't a bad thing. This is a good thing. And that is about as conservative as I'd expect. That's like someone who's... You know, they're a pretty serious person, but you know, they, they like want to cut loose a bit. They want to get into the dancing vibes. That is exactly what that is called. Okay. And it's called the hustle. <laughs> oh my God. I love that. You imagine Mercy just coming into the point, rezzing everyone and then just like, and then just doing like a bit of a hustle when she's still in her immune mode. That is what I want to see. Oh my God. Just dancing emotes, man. Can you imagine like... You're defending the cart in overtime. The enemy team is running towards it. Overtime's ticking down. And the defenders are just like dancing on the cart. Because they know nobody is going to get there in time. Okay, here we go. The last three boxes and still no Genji. Two boxes left. Come on. Come on. This is the final countdown for the Genji skin that I really need. I'm not saying want, I'm saying need because it is a need. And oh, look at that butt. They saved the best butt emote. Oh my God. Can you imagine if that was Tracer? No one would ever leave spawn. <laughs> They'd just be like a single Tracer. Just sitting there mesmerizing everyone. Okay, the final box. And then we're going to go into the training range and we'll kind of check out some of the cool ones for those of you who haven't seen them in game yet. Here we go. Give me the Genji. Don't let me down. Make it a good one. And it's going to be an emote. And it's not even a dancing sombra. God. Okay, it's training gallery time. Let's check out the cool ones.
All right, guys, instead of the training range, I brought us here into Sombra's bedroom, which is one of the new maps. Not not just Sombra's bedroom. The map is bigger than Sombra's bedroom. But one of the new elimination maps is actually set here on Dorado, just like the actual massive big Dorado payload map. And I believe if you look down there, yeah, you can actually see the Dorado payload map. They're the three bells if you look all the way down there. It's pretty damn cool. But we're going to quickly go through and look at some of the cool skins. The one I really want to check out, though, as I think we all know, is Lucio. Come on, oh my god! Did you guys hear that? Let's try... Listen to this. I'm going to be quiet for a second. You guys need to listen. That's awesome. Heal up. How amazing is that? That is actually some of the coolest stuff. I think I, this is like a must equip skin. There is no one who would not equip that new Lucio skin. That is just amazing. I realized we also didn't get the new Symmetra skin. Oh my God. So much stuff we're missing out on. Let's quickly try out Zenyatta. These dance emotes look amazing. Okay. What else? What, what are the other skins that we got? We got 76 with his new gun. That gun looks really cool, actually. I really like that. And his... Not so enthusiastic dancing emote. <laughs> okay. And then back to Swan, we'll do one last skin or one last, uh, what's it going to be? I ended up buying the new Genji. And we got the dancing emote to go with it. But there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video. If you want to enter the giveaway for $200 of Battle.net gift cards, just make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Leave a comment down below, and I will pick one of you out of the pack within the next week or so and send you the $200 worth of Battle.net gift cards. But as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for coming along on this unboxing journey. And I will see you, legends, in the next one. Bye-bye.